Kim Mitchell. I'm 35 years old and I'm a chef. I have my own restaurant, Kathleen's. I'm going to introduce to you a home video, one that Lucy, my boyfriend Andrew's daughter, took a couple years ago on Christmas. Andrew was always trying to get Lucy and I to spend more time together and well one night he brought her over and left and we accidentally got snowed in with a friend of mine. Lucy's an angry girl. We don't get along. Well, we didn't get along then. She reminds me a lot of myself at that age. Well, we had a great day, the day that this video was taped, and um, we played out in the snow, we did plays, and then I said something crappy to her and the whole thing blew up. I guess I don't let people get close to me. I think I was pushing her away. Ever since my dad died, when I was 10, Lucy's age, I just don't trust people. I don't let anybody in. I mean, if your father leaves, you want everybody else. It's getting late. I should be in bed. Thank you, Sam, for a wonderful evening, and thank you, Kathleen, for running it. Sounds tiring. It's exhausting. But here's the thing. I've never been able to shake it. I can move the feelings around, organize them nice and neat so the wrong ones don't bump into each other. And then the smallest thing happens and I'm right there. Where? Alone. And watching my dad walk out on me. That's hard. My whole world collapsed. when I was about 10, around Lucy's age. It still doesn't make sense to me. How about your mother? My mother? No. Oh, I'm sorry, when did she pass? Oh, she's alive and kicking. I just try not to let her kick me. You don't get along? Oh, well, we used to. The closer I got to my mom, the more I noticed that my dad was absent. And then she remarried. And I started blaming her. Why? Because she was there. And I mean, it was either her or me. I moved out as soon as I could get away from it all. But a funny thing happened. Those same feelings came here with me when I came here. And there was no one else to blame but myself. It's not your fault. You were just a kid. Everyone says that. Because it's a truth. The truth is my dad didn't care. Not enough. How can you know that? Because I was there when he left. I've lived it so many times. We had just decorated our Christmas tree. It was beautiful. Simple but perfect. So there I was under the Christmas tree when my dad came rushing down the hall, right past me out the door. He didn't see me. So I knocked. He stopped. He looked right at me. And then he turned around and walked away. Have you ever tried to get in touch with him? Why? He was the one who left. Besides, he could find me if he wanted to. It's not always that simple. Your story could just as soon be mine. Why? Did your dad leave you? No. It was me who did the leaving, sorry to say. 